Eat, drink, curl. That's the motto at Broomstack Kitchen and Tap House in Maple City. It's a place you drop in for a meal, pick up a game on the ice, or even both. 9 10's Lawrence Cavitti taking us inside the kitchen, explaining the way this unique restaurant all got started. Broomstack Kitchen and Tap House threw themselves into Maple City three years ago, bringing both food and fun to northern Michigan. So let's go inside the kitchen. They're just addicting. One of many words to describe the Brussels sprouts. And the texture is just out of this world. I mean, they are so crunchy and crispy and perfect. Thank you, thank you very much. But customer Angela Consitis says you can't go wrong with anything at Broomstack Kitchen and Tap House. It's very earthy, mm -hmm. but very upscale. Um, coming into Maple City, you wouldn't probably think you'd find a restaurant of this caliber, mm -hmm. and it's just really great. On the lighter side, a beautiful beet salad or the salmon cakes. On the heartier side, maybe the root vegetable hash or the beef brisket. One of my favorites, absolutely beautiful flavor all the way through. Um, every element of the sandwich shines. Chef Pat Stowe says there are two main objectives, locally sourced and made from scratch. Every day is, you know, something new. Like I said, we're always constantly changing our menu, coming up with new stuff. But the staples keep people coming back. This is an absolute tower of a burger, uh, real shock and awe for everybody. The one, the coveted Broomstack Cowboy Burger. All right, we're going to start stacking now. A solid foundation, then burger, bacon, golden brown onion rings, and house-made barbecue. This one takes a lot of determination to get through. And oh, so good. The food is only one third of their motto. Eat, drink, curl. David Gersonson co-owns the restaurant and curling center. Or you go two to 12, and the stone's gonna curl counterclockwise. It'll curl right to left. He teaches other people the sport. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> that was really good. He has grown to love. My saying is, old or young, big or small, athletic or arthritic, anybody's able to curl. So when you're done sliding across the ice for the day, there's just one very important step left. Broom stacking is what you do after a curling match. So you'll have your game, and traditionally you would then stack your brooms, you sit down with the other team, and you converse, you, and you, you have a beverage. Inside the kitchen at Broomstack Kitchen and Tap House, I'm Lauren Scafidi. And if you've never curled before, that's perfectly okay. They offer learn to curl classes. If there's a restaurant you'd like us to feature, we'd love to hear from you. Just send us an email to inside the kitchen at 9and10news.com.